Hey pretty girls, thanks for tuning in to my channel. Now let's get into this traditional sewing install. Today I'll just be showing you all how I do an install using my um, Amber Nicole Raw Brazilian bundles. I want to say we used two 22 inches and one 20 inch bundle. And we did um, dye them black for her install. Here, I'm just blow drying her hair prior to braiding her down for her install. Usually, I do, um, after blowing the hair out, I do like to give it a good trim just so that they have a good foundation for their sewing. And the reason I say that is because typically a sewing is a protective style. So, I mean, the goal is to, um, of course, protect your hair, but you also do want it to grow underneath. So be sure to um, do a treatment, um, do a trim, you know, make sure you give your hair a really good prep before you go ahead and do an install. They are supposed to last for like two to three months, y'all. Um, okay, here I'm just going ahead and braiding her hair. Remember, the smaller the braids, the flatter the install. That I cannot stress. People with super thick hair, I saw it stresses me out because it's like, girl, how am I going to get all of that hair under these braids? <laughs> I mean, how am I going to get all of this hair braided under this install? So her first two bundles I did install off camera. And the first bundle, I will tell you I did fill up the nape area and then the second bundle I double that bundle and I also make sure I fill up my sides first that way most of the middle is actually the third bundle and that I don't double just so that it's pretty flat at the top I mean uh, the other bundles are flat also but I feel like for a, a true flat install at the top it needs to be one weft only One of the questions I used to always ask as a new stylist was, are they going through the wefts or are they going under the wefts? And I will tell you, I am going under the wefts. For the beginning of the track, I do like to go through the, the actual wefts so that it's um, well secured, like a good base. But everything else, I just go under the weft. And that's so that the install doesn't take as long also um it helps with the bundle shedding as fast when you go through the wefts you kind of like disturbing the, the actual the hair So after completing her install, I did go ahead and blow dry her hair on a high setting just to knock out that natural wave. And I will tell you, um, depending on how they're getting their hair styled, I will go in with a ceramic iron and do like a rough press just so I could get a really good cut. In this case, she was going bone straight, so I just went in with the babyliss one and one fourth, and I pressed her hair. To do her natural hair, I did use the Amber Nicole Professional Bling High Comb, which I'll link the um, I'll link that below for you all. And I also used the one inch Babyliss on her natural hair. After I had everything pressed, I went ahead and used the FHI. I want to say it might be one and a half inch or one and a fourth. I don't know, but I used the FHI ceramic iron to go ahead and seal her natural hair into the bundles. And I'm just gonna give y'all a few seconds just to appreciate the quality of these bundles. Ooh, they look like silk.
thanks for watching be sure to like subscribe and comment down below also be sure to follow me on instagram and tiktok at amber nicole hair